Hey guys, on today's tutorial I'm going to teach you how to import a new iPhoto library into your new photos app. Okay, so no matter what you want to erase the previous one you got or you just want another one to import there, this is the way to do it. Uh, so here's my photos app. Now what we want to do is go into Finder. Under Finder we want to get to pictures and we'll see this. So I'll show you how to get there. Um, so most of you will have downloads, documents. Um, what I want you guys to go into is your iMac or whatever name your Mac is and then you guys are gonna go into pictures and in pictures you'll see this if um, you don't see that if you don't have this option in your computer don't worry about it just go to documents that for sure you have you can right click on that for right clicking you can just click on do a normal click plus press your control up key on your keyboard and you'll get this option okay so that's the same thing as your right clicking then uh, click on the second option which shows show in closing folder from there you guys are gonna see this okay so that's another way to get to here um, once you go into pictures you're gonna see this your photos library plus your iPhoto so I already took it out of here so that's why we don't see it so mine is already right here I put it on a USB stick uh, to put it on a USB stick I can just drag and drop it or copy and paste it um, and that's what I did and then I deleted it from here that's just because I didn't need it anymore but anyways um, so you guys would see this library right there so what you guys can do is delete the one that you have right here or you can just leave that one there if you want and you can just put in the new one that you have so if you have another one from another computer for example you can just drag and drop this one right here so for sure, drag and drop it, okay? This one's quite huge, so I'm not gonna do that right now because it's uh, 60 gigs, so it's gonna take a while. Um, but anyways, let's imagine that's there already. Now, that's not the last step. What we want to do right now is the last step, which is just clicking on your Photos Library app. But before you click on it, press your Option or Alt key. Now that's right beside your Command key on your keyboard, okay? Whether you have an iMac, MacBook Pro, same thing. Right beside your Command key, there's the Option key. So hold that and then click on your Photos. And you're gonna see this. Right here is where you guys will see Photos and your iPhoto, okay? So click on your second option. Now I don't have another second option right here since I didn't do the copy and pasting. Now if you guys did the copy and pasting, you guys still can't see it right here. Don't worry, just click on other library. So we're gonna click on that option. And you guys should see your iPhoto library like I told you to copy and paste it here. However, if you didn't do that like I didn't right now, which I highly suggest doing, um, you can just go to, well, for this example, my USB stick here, and then just click on my photos library, click on open, and once I do that, okay, once I do that, it's gonna import all that library into my Photos app. So I can just launch this. So I can just close this or just click on choose library, okay? And from there, once you choose the correct one, you can just launch your Photos app and it's gonna import everything. And then you're pretty much done. So that's it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, you can write them down here below. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.